This dragonfly is grabbing its meal on the go. This attempt is so fast that unless we film it in high speed, we can't see whether it caught the prey, but when it gets back to its perch, if we see it chewing, we know that it was successful. Harvard University biomechanist Stacy Combs wants to understand how dragonflies pull off these complicated aerial feats, hunting and even reproducing in midair. She and her team set up their lab near a pond outside Boston, right in the heart of dragonfly country. All right, I got one. I lost it. Yeah. Clearly it's not easy to catch a dragonfly. I got one. Check out this frog. In this specially built netted enclosure, Combs' team set up eight high-speed cameras. Then they release a dragonfly and some tasty fruit fly prey to watch what happens next. They'll go up in midair, catch the prey with their hands or with their feet, turn upside down and glide back to the stick and the whole capture will take maybe a second or a second and a half. This one is missing about half of its left front wing um, and yet it still does an amazing job catching this fruit fly in midair. It only takes about half a second for this to happen. They caught, you know, about 90 or 95 percent of the prey that we gave them. And interestingly, they're one of the most ancient groups of insects. They've had a long time to evolve their skills as predators. About 300 million years. These four-winged insects predate dinosaurs. They can fly straight up, straight down, hover like helicopters, and disappear in a blur. And their eyesight? Almost its whole head is eye. They can see pretty much all the way around their head, except right behind them. Dragonflies mate and lay eggs in flight. Do you see her like just dipping in the water? Yeah. yeah. She's trying to lay eggs and the male's trying to mate with her. Comb says engineers are looking to the dragonfly for inspiration in small-scale aircraft design. There's a lot of interest in building, you know, robotic, small robotic devices. And she says better understanding of dragonflies could lead to more effective mosquito control strategies. They may consume 30 mosquitoes a day. They could even consume hundreds a day. And that's an idea that could really take flight. For Science Nation, I'm Miles O'Brien.